Hi there, this is David Detman for Bonus Tips. And today I'm going to talk about TED Notepad. Alright, why use TED Notepad? Well, I use it simply because I had a problem where I needed to remove duplicate numbers. Uh, I had a list of mobile phone numbers, and I'll show you it in a second, uh, where I was just sending out SMS and I was sending out duplicates to people and I needed a solution okay so what I did was I found this notepad and found I could remove duplicates and that's just one feature of it uh, just to let you know if you like using notepads uh, this is definitely the notepad I use alright Scroll back up the top. Okay, this is what it looks like. Alright. There's all sorts of things you can do. Uh, a lot of these features I haven't used. But if you use notepads a lot, I'm sure these features are going to help you. For instance, this is the one I use. Lines, find duplicates. You can find unique. Uh, you can put in all sorts of things. Uh, you can have clipboards where there's several clipboards. You can have like a word wizard where you've got words which come up. A bit like on a mobile phone, I suppose. I've never used it, so I couldn't tell you. Put in quotes. Okay, so it look if you're going to use it, have a look through here if you really want to get to the technical side. I think it's probably best we just have a play with it. Alright, so this is the notepad. Alright, what I'll do, we'll, put, we'll, we'll play with the voice recognition on this computer. <laughs> As you can see, it always stuffs up. <laughs> okay, so we've got some text there. Wonder why I never used the voice recognition on this thing. All right. Okay, so let's highlight the line. Actually, first I just want to show you something real cool. Um, what you can do is you can put the date in. You get an option of dates here, long date. All right. Okay, now. Yeah. Lines. I'm unique. So I meant find duplicates. Uh. All lines remove duplicates. Okay, so it didn't do it with that. <clears throat> but for instance, if I was to go like this, copy. I've never done it with text before. Select all. Eyes. All lines. Remove duplicates. Okay, so it saw there was a duplicate line. Alright. 
selection is empty, select some text first. Oh, I'm just having a bit of a play here, don't mind me. <laughs> The selection is empty. Select some text first. <laughs> How's that? It just backwards the text. Alright. So, I mean, look, you can see it does a whole lot of neat things. I like, what I'll do is I open up. Same current changes to untitled. I'll open a um, phone number list just so you can see how I actually use it. All right, one one of the things I like about this is you can see here it's showing the lines and it's showing how many lines. So, that, for instance, there's 390 mobile numbers in here. Okay. Now, if I copy that. So just put in some gobbledygook and I paste okay now I'll add in another number which I know is not in here all right now if I select all okay and we use this lines business and find duplicates what's going to happen is all those numbers I just copied will be removed and there'll be the gobbledygook and that one number you watch all lines remove duplicate okay this is where these duplicate numbers are and that's the unique number okay so from that point of view this, this was a solving dramatically solved the problem I had uh, because I do send a lot of text messages out as part of some of the work I do so that was really cool but for instance I would just try this it's free I mean I know I cover a lot of free things I will be covering a few paid things too but I like to try and cover things which you can just use well I mean you can you can see that all the various things you can do in here. I don't want to bore you going through and playing with each of them. But I just thought it was a really cool tool. Alright. Okay, try it. I've never had a problem with it. I've got it on two of my computers. Use it all the time. I mean, for instance, I mean, this is your Microsoft tools. Okay, this is your TE notepad tools. Plus it's got, you know, this sort of thing, which you really want. You know, like, knowing the lines especially for certain things, especially for dealing with numbers and, or, you know, like you want to do a word count, for instance. You know, if you're writing an article, it needs to be so many words, well... You know, you've got a guide here of what's going on. All right, so I hope this is a great feature. Let me know how you go with it. Uh, once again, it's saved me a lot of money in duplicate text alone. And um, like I say, it is free. Have a play with it. Come and have a read. This is a few technical bits of jargon. You know, I don't like to go too technical. But come and have a look at this page. So it'll sort of give you an idea of what you can do. Alright, so this has been David Detman for bonus tips. And um, once again, leave your feedback and also uh, don't forget to visit the uh, new toolbar. This is the toolbar here. It's part of the MSS slash social network toolbar. If you don't have that, uh, ask me how you can get it. It's it's broadcasted nearly everywhere at the moment. So once again, have a great day.